all welcome to Rodgers Food Science I'm Chitra Puniswamy please read my name as is shown on the slide and not in the caption I'm the undergrad program director of food science and I'm really excited to connect with all of you today and give you a brief overview of our program at SEBS Rutgers we all eat foods a lot of foods every single day yet when we see some unfamiliar foods we call them exotic for example the insect flower that goes into the making of these chips how do we do that well it's all in the science within food science that goes into the manufacture of various foods that are available for us to enjoy Food science draws from many disciplines such as biology, chemistry, chemical engineering and biochemistry and all of the foods we consume on a daily basis goes through a lot of food research, systematic investigations into the various properties, compositions and the constituents of foods. Food industry is the largest manufacturing industry in the United States. Coming in as a food science major, you need to understand that it's a major that is very heavy on basic sciences and math. All the students go through biology, chemistry, calculus, physics, statistics, organic chemistry, and biochemistry. These sciences lead you to understand what's behind the various foods, the various processing aspects, and the associated technologies that are utilized in the development and manufacture of food products. Students need a strong foundation in these basic sciences so that they understand the reactions that take place among the various components in foods. In order to manufacture foods, all students need to understand the processing techniques, equipment, and the related operational principles. And for these, a good background in calculus and physics are essential. The major courses we offer cover all necessary aspects of food science that students need to establish a career after they graduate as well as pursue grad programs. What do you need to graduate from food science? Completion of the requirements that is for the school as well as the major and the core. A complete listing of various courses and all of the information is posted in our website. Please do visit our undergrad food science website and you will get a lot of information from the site. At Rutgers, we offer five different options of study. All of these options are equally targeted for a great career start in food industries. Food, ind food science is a credit intensive, highly structured program of study and students do not have a lot of room for free choice courses. Our research option is a pre-med option with one year study of calculus, physics and upper level organic chemistry and this option has two additional food science courses. In the general option there is wiggle room for elective courses and students can customize these credits to create a unique resume for themselves. These electives are constructed to courses specific to management, marketing, food economics in the management option, sustainability and resource-based courses in the sustainability option, and animal science courses in the pet food science option. Pet food science and sustainability are two new options that we have recently introduced in our program. We have about 40 graduating students each year from our department. The next question comes, does culinary help with food science? Yes, culinary arts programs do not have science and math courses that are required for food science, but culinology programs tie in very well with food science program. We have linkage with Mercer County Community College with their culinology program. So when students complete their culinology program and come to us as transfer students, they will pursue all of their food science courses. And with a background of culinology, a degree in food science gives these students very unique opportunities like research chefs in industries. 
While studying at Rutgers, mm -hmm. SABS offers study abroad courses. These may be of interest to students. Food Science Department has started a study abroad course, Sustain Food and Sustainability in Thailand during the winter break. It was very well received by the first batch of students. We do offer department level scholarships to our students in our program. You may want to check out Rutgers and SCBS scholarships as well. Our food science program is IFT approved. IFT gives out scholarships of $1,500 to eligible students who declare their major as food science. Commitment to food science major needs to be shown in order to receive these monies. Where do our students go after they graduate? There are various career paths they can choose from. New Jersey is not a food commodity state. There are a lot of value added industries for colors, flavors, ingredients, and so on. It's also the location in New Jersey that gives an edge to our students who get a job within food industries. Many of our students go for one or two internships while they are in the program and they get jobs offered via internships. There are good job opportunities projected and a good potential for career growth within various food industries. Food science program can truly boast of its undergrad club, which is a robust student run organization with two well-experienced faculty advisors steering them. They arrange for industry visits. They make ice cream for Rutgers Day. And they connect with our alumni for in jobs, internships, grad programs, various other activities. With this, I conclude my presentation. I do want you to visit our website for all of the information on our program. My contact is available on the slide as well as in our website. Do take an appointment using the link provided to talk to me further. I thank you for your interest in our program. Good luck and stay safe.